attempts at workers of the Central City Protein Distribution Center. All workers should go directly home following the scheduled work shift. Any people caught outside after the shift will be collected and detained indefinitely. A paralyzer will be deployed at an unspecified time if necessary. The CFU reminds you that this is for your own safety and well-being. For our own safety and well-being, they're going to paralyze us and detain us indefinitely. That makes me feel so much safer. It'd be wise to keep comments like that to yourself. We have people lined up around the block, ready to replace you. You better watch your mouth, or you'll be out on the streets. I'm sorry, sir. I didn't mean anything by it. I was just blowing off steam at the end of a long day. It won't happen again. It better not. Remember, we have video surveillance everywhere. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. class function well. This is Brandon. Brandon is 8th grade. He also has a learning disability. I like band class, Brandon. What do you think about it? Do you, do you have fun? Yeah. you have fun in band? Yeah. Every town needs a superhero, but this town has six. More precisely, five and Tommy. Gregory is Dayglo, with the power of glowing in the day and being invisible at night. Eleanor is the social justice warrior. For justice, she will fight. Wesley, the temporary titan, could hold the world for five seconds and then drop it. Whitney is trash magnet. She hates the smell, but won't quit. Clementine, the fruit whisperer. All Earth's fruit will follow her. And <sighs> Tommy, the super edgy super teen, is light switch, able to steal light. Their superpowers may be watered down, but they'll pull together to save this town. The Super Average Superheroes.